we're back for another Dokkan Battle video, and we are here at the request of the homie Goresh. Yes. To use both these units at the same time, right? So, Goresh, sure, go ahead. Explain your hypothesis around these units. I mean, it's just... You build the whole team around that package of links. It's shocking speed, solid support, turn of power, fierce battle, legendary power. It's like every single unit on this team has those five links. Mm. And then you just win. That's it. You won. Congratulations. This is this leads me to my point of why I was annoyed with the way they built Gohan and Piccolo. And the fact that Gohan and Piccolo do not have shocking speed greatly annoyed me. And now this rears its ugly head for this as well. Because Gohan and Piccolo and Gohan and Frieza, I mean... Uh, now that I know that they activate their buff at the start of turn, they don't have to actually attack first. That does make them quite a bit better in my eyes, right? But, like, I don't... I don't know, Dokkan, like, they try and be funny sometimes. Like, <laughs> speedy retribution! It's like, w w dude, why? <laughs> can, we, can we not do that? Is that okay? So... The build, too, with this, right, is that, like, like we, we kind of just let uh, 17 and Golden Frieza build up a little bit in slot 1, but that LR Universe 7, when they super attack 12 or 18 key super attack, they give a 30% defensive increase to the entire rotation, and I believe they're only, it's only the third unit in the game that does that behind uh, the physical LR Ginyu Force. Wow, we could use this already, huh? I mean... Yeah, because he's wanting to move less than 50% health. Yeah. You don't want to use it yet, but... <laughs> Might as well. Yeah. Whatever. Go ahead and blow him away. See if they have a... a wait, wait, wait. No, no, yeah, use it, Hydra. See if they have a unique uh, finisher for finishing him off with it. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, that, that's... What, okay, so that's the thing. Like, the Vegito Blue and Gogeta Blue active skills, as impressive as they are, like, that's turn six or later. Here we are turn two using this. So that means this could be a really devastating attack in Super Battle Road, like turn two, right? I mean, yeah. If, you, if, you, if there's a stage with like two enemies, are you, and you kidding me? Kill one super quick. That's disappointing. <laughs> Wait, you like the smoke? They couldn't. No, have, it's the most. It's the best thing ever. They couldn't have put them all posing or something. Okay. Like... Okay. Wait. This is where you start putting the int one first. Because then he just gives the defense buff to the rest of the rotation, and you can't die. You can't get hurt. Like you, you can't take damage. You win. Now check, so. check. I want to check. Check their defenses real fast, Tydros. Okay, not the craziest. Check. Click the int one. Let me see his links active. Oh yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. The two of them together. They're nasty, dirty, filthy boys. That's for sure. All right. So let's see how this rotation goes. And then Team Universe 7 busts out the very balanced and fair 7 million attacks set. Okay. <laughs> I'd say that's pretty good, you know? So now the rest of the rotation has a big defensive buff. That, dude, that effect, I love that so much. I, like, I, that's really going to give that Universe 7 unit, like, a lot of extra life. All right. You do the, no, no, no. Put Goku and Freeze in slot two. Yeah, perfect. No, well, you just had it. Yep, there you go. Make sure you want to get the rainbow orbs. Yep, there you go. Because the thing with them is as long as you get the 22 key with them, their damage is off the charts. Here's where Goku and Freeze are hurt a little bit by the Link level update too, by the way. They'd have so much more key right now if not for that damage. They should have checked their defense. I think the one, the Android 17, like after the super attack, he's saw like 300k defense. I wish you could see defensive stats, like, after, like, Supers. And I Super have been there. asking for that for, like, two years. Yeah, I wish that, too. Show it right underneath the attack stat or something. Or, like, a, a pop-up that shows defense increasing. Yeah, yeah. Literally, they could just, yeah, yeah. Like, an RPG level up or something like that, right? Like, just see, like... Hmm. Uh, I'm not gonna lie. I just look at this Universe Seven LR and like my mouth is watering. Like there's, this is so Ooh. good. This unit is so good. It's <laughs> so crazy. See their defense. One fifty two, one fifty one. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I, I I see. I see. I see what your point is because, so as they attack, that defense is gonna go up and up and up and up and up for the Golden Freeze on seventeen. But then they're also going to have damage reduction as they're attacking as well. 
Yeah. 7.5. And it's just every turn, 7 million attack stats. Just every turn. Very consistently. There was a little bit of support there, because Gohan and Frieza are a support type unit. Yeah, but that's why I put them on there. This is good, right? Because, like, reps of Universe 7, as small of a category as it is, right? Which, with these two units added to reps of Universe 7, like, me in my box, I would have 37 units. But you could still build this in numerous different ways, right? Because you now have the LR Roshi, who's the great Turtle School support type unit. You know, you have all the UI Gokus. You've got Krillin, who's solid. Now you have these two LRs you can build around. It, it's, yeah. I mean, you know, it turns out when you release four summonable LRs for a category in one uh, anniversary or one celebration, that category is a lot better, huh? Hmm. Oh, this is the double super turn. Yeah, we're invincible now. <laughs> I'm giving my team Universe 7 full uh, additionals, by the way, for sure. Yeah, I think that would be the play. They're getting a level 2 bronze additional. They're getting a level 5 silver and a level 5 gold additional. We're just... Additionals. Please, Super. He's not going to. Damn. And then this Gohan and Piccolo are at like 350k defense or something. Yeah, because they get, what, 120% on Super Attack. So that's a huge like number they're going to be able to push out. Oh! Uh, let's actually just let uh Golden Frieza and Seventeen finish this one off, and we we could maybe save that one for a little bit later because we want to keep building up their passive a little bit, right? It's like I like what they did with them, but hmm, I mean, like you said, they are just Gohan and Goten, right? It's the same sort of thing, just for like reps of Universe Seven instead. I would say they're just way better defensively because yeah. of the team that they're on. And also because of this other in unit, right? He's just, he makes them look so much better. I'm a little disappointed that neither of these units have KO screens, though. That's kind of like, uh, right? Like, definitely would be a lot better with that. The only thing I could really see this team using to become better is an orb changer. Are there any orb changers on this team besides like 18? There's not. But like, cause it's like, yeah. it's, it's, I just never understood why Krillin was not a rainbow orb changer. Cause Krillin is like, he's, he's good, but like, he's, he's just, he's good. Right. But like he came out with Goku and Vegeta. I don't understand why he didn't create rainbow orbs to pair with them. It just, it was odd. Yeah. To me. Cause like you take out all that nonsense about, you know, he gets stronger with Android 18, right? Just get that right out of there and give him rainbow orb changing instead. And he's a hundred times better. All right, well, hold on, because this guy is also an int leader. Um, yeah. Super int. So you could do go tanks and ghosts. <laughs> yeah, go tanks and ghosts, I guess you could do. <laughs> yeah. That could help this team, to be honest. Go tanks and ghosts. What, what is there? It's 100% they give? In 4K, yeah. Because the go tanks and ghosts unit is good, right? Like, he's not. That sol he's solid enough to. No item, one of the hardest stages in the game. So he's definitely solid. Uh, and then there's also the spirit, bo the D-transforming Goku, right? Yeah. I think yeah. I think so good. He's, better. he's a little mid, huh? <laughs> well, we could run the 50% uh, support Gohan. I mean, he's not creating rainbow orbs, but he is creating int orbs, which could be useful. You could do the active skill and just be invincible for, uh, for this turn if you want. Or we could do this the one? universe 7. At, yeah, you just, yeah just... do the universe 7 or whatever. <laughs> it doesn't matter. Yeah, it's just, yeah, Doesn't these matter. guys are good together. No, no, use the universe, the universe seven one first, because if you finish it off, right? Yeah. This looks really good, too. Just like all of them blasting together. I love that. I remember this was you're our. Into, idea. You're into group scenes, I, I guess, truth. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I, that, I, the meme, that's me sitting on the couch with the guys behind me. That's, that's me, all right? Um, now the I thing is, the windscreen could have been like all of them like together, like yes. post that that blast after the fight. The oh no, 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 you know, no, you know what the windscreen could have been? It could have been that like five way split screen. Oh yeah, yeah. 
Because it's like they did that with the the Spirit Bomb and Sword Goku, right? Where it like it the, the shot of him like you know I don't know gumming at the screen or whatever the hell we want to say. Yeah, I, you know what you could do on this rotation. <laughs> yeah, do that right so, there. So wait, no, no, wait, hold on. Because the turn where you have seventeen floating, if you put the int one in the middle, he gets all the links. So if you ever have a turn where you're not getting attacked in that first slot, yeah, you can do, do this. Don't do that. No, I know. I know. I'm just saying that you can do that. That's an option. They give oh. you all links active. I know. I was just I was just making sure Hydra's didn't do it because Goku and Frieza couldn't take that. No, I was so flipping I it because to show what Goresh was saying. Mm, okay. But I'm not going to actually do that. Uh, I am very curious at this turn because I want to see. Check what 17's defense is right now, real fast, before the turn starts. He's at. Uh, okay, perfect. Uh, so he's taken like. 100k damage per normal or more right here so i would love to see how much damage he's going to take after team universe 7 super attacks and gives that defensive buff all right that'll do damage but we'll be okay oof okay 6.95 okay okay there's one super attack okay so again i, I think 17 will be taking 100k ish on a normal um without universe 7 super attack we entered the rotation with like full health right we were full health yeah we, so he's not he doesn't have his damage reduction okay okay all right, now we're invincible. Just pop. Oh, this is a good turn. Yeah, yeah, it is. But no, put seventeen first. Well, you, you yeah. yeah, yeah, you could just pop the active skill whenever though. Pop the active skill. Okay. Yeah. yeah. So this this is really good because this will allow them every attack is a crit, so they're just gonna cut right through this SCRUI Goku too. Hmm. I like it. Look at their defense. Mm. That's gonna, that's so. Hold on. Uh, they're not fully built up yet either, by the way. So they're gonna be at three hundred and eighty-four k after they get the buff. But I don't think they haven't done seven hits yet, right? Either. Yeah, and then they're also gonna get damage reduction on top of that. Yeah. I would love to see. Well. I was gonna say I'd love to see what SCRU I Goku would do, but I think it would be double digits, right? Oh, don't don't do this, I just because he probably would kill with all the extra damage. He's at seven point five. It's just so easy for that LR to do this level of damage, right? Like I thought he was going to get an additional there. I was about to say, <laughs> you actually are invincible. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, even if this guy's super easy, you're going to take double digits. So It's really good damage. Oh, here we go. Nice. Well, doesn't matter. Very impressive. So, as you guys can see, these two LRs are very good. Very, very good. Definitely designed to be used together. You know, the Gohan and Frieza, the Gohan and Piccolo, like all these dual units are incredible, amazing, fantastic. But guess what, free to play players? Skippity skip, skip this shit because these units are restricted to like pretty much just like, you know, reps unit or seven, turn on power and stuff like that. I don't know that you really need buffs for these two teams like even free-to-play players are going to be fully built up on great reps of universe 7 characters and stuff like that so this seems like a very easy skip i think if you're a free-to-play player right so thanks guys for watching uh let me know what you guys think of these two new lrs uh, and i'll catch y'all next time